Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to tell you about Milanote versus Figma. Let's dive into these two powerful tools, both loved by creatives but built for different purposes. Milanote is a visual organization tool designed for brainstorming, mood boarding, and project planning. It's like a digital whiteboard where you can drag and drop notes, images, links, and tasks. Milanote is perfect for creatives like writers, designers, and teams who want to map out ideas in a flexible, freeform way. Whether you're storyboarding a video, organizing a design concept, or gathering research for a project, Milanote offers an intuitive way to structure your thoughts visually. On the other hand, Figma is a collaborative design tool focused on UX design, prototyping, and real-time teamwork. It's a browser-based platform that lets designers create wireframes, design interfaces, and build interactive prototypes all while collaborating live with their team. Figma is essential for product designers, app developers, and teams working on user experiences and digital designs. I have created a comparison table for you. If you're a creative who loves brainstorming visually, organizing ideas, and building project plans, Milanote is your ideal tool. It's perfect for mood boards, storytelling, and structuring thoughts in a freeform way great for writers, artists, and designers working on concepts. But if your focus is on designing user interfaces, creating prototypes, and collaborating on app or web design, Figma is the way to go. It's packed with design tools and live collaboration features, making it a must-have for UX designers and product teams. In short, go with Milanote for brainstorming, mood boards, and visual project planning. Choose Figma for UX design, wireframing, and interactive prototyping. Let me know in the comments which tool matches your workflow best. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more app comparisons. See you in the next one.